see patients i'm basically waiting for them to deliver folders here um so that i can see the patients actually we're expected to see like 25 patients in a period of two weeks so this is week two of ophthalmology i did week one last week but i've gotten around seven eight patients of which is not going well because there are no patients like they said previously there used to be like a lot of patients that's why they expected us to see like quite a lot of patients but right now literally i'm sitting with one folder here and while i'm reading it they say this is a 15 year old 50 year old woman she's deaf she's dumb how am i gonna get a history how am i gonna tell her to look to the left and look to the right so i'm not gonna see that patient because i'm not gonna get much from it so i'm basically just chilling here waiting for them to deliver a new folder so that i can get a patient to see hopefully today i'll be able to see five patients because sits the side puts their chin here and we are able to see their eye right here i'm going to see if i can show you when i'm trying to take my patient's photo and then this camera turns on and then you can take a photo and then reflect on that computer it is actually so so cool excited about yeah. that uh, if she's not if she if she were diabetic yeah then you'd look at that as a easy is that a small exudate there but okay. it's not it's not it's not classically and there's nothing much around it mm. uh, that, that, that kind of looks like it might be a little human showing you where the edge of the cup is so his cup is actually goes all the way to there can you appreciate that yes yes I and then the vessel sure goes that. up the side of the cup and then there. oh yeah. so so that's actually called the bayonet sign they might have told you about that in the, in the lectures so this has got that name now because you have the one and then you have a step and then you have another mm -hmm. straight line okay so that's why we call it the bayonet sign so this is the one and then there's a step and then there's the other one and that step is showing you the edge of the cup in this patient okay, okay. so you're using the blood vessel shape to tell you where the edge of the cup and is. this is still like this part of the atrophy this is all atrophy here and i wouldn't yeah you know, i wouldn't put any i wouldn't comment on the vessel here it's changing directions 
but yeah. this is what we call the bayonet sign because it's showing you the end of the cup. Okay, because I'm seeing like a pin thing around. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah I think we're seeing thing. actually some choroidal vessels here as well. I think this is, see these vessels here, these choroidal vessels? Yes. I think we're just seeing some in the atrophic area. So I wouldn't comment too much about this except to say that's atrophy. And then the cup egg, the disc egg is there, and then this, the one vessel is helping us to see the cup end. Okay. So this is where we test visual acuity. We bring patients here to read um, these letters or words. You probably have seen this somewhere somehow if you went to an optometrist. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. First things first, I want to go buy a little bit of groceries, the things that I ran out of, and then um, I want to shoot a YouTube video, and then I want to shoot a couple of TikTok videos as well. So yeah, I have quite a lot to do, and then from there, I'll just jump into my schoolwork. I'll catch you guys a bit later. And if you're wondering, I'm shooting on my phone, not on my camera. That's why the quality is a bit, you know, I'm sorry about that. 